For this talk, we'll explore issues of Hinduism and modernity, including issues of freedom, fundamentalism, democracy, individualism, science, and secularism. So, ladies and gentlemen, a big, nice, warm welcome for Shonaka Rishidas. Hinduism and modernity is a tricky kind of a, an issue because we have to define modernity and no one's ever done it successfully. Um, we have to define Hinduism and no one's ever done that successfully either. So to kind of pick two words that are difficult. We all seem to know what they, th what they mean, but no one's really defined them. European phenomena, the idea of historical consciousness severely um, challenged Christianity because people and critical thinking because they start to um, be separated from the first time from traditional thinking. So previous, the idea was to build on the past. Whatever has gone on in the past, then we build on that and we move forward. This was essentially you critically analyze and reduce the past and then you move forward. It's a very, very different way of, of thinking. And we can see that that's the basis of science, it's the basis of empiricism, of rational thought, basis of our educational system in the West. So it was a specific Western phenomenon. Experiment. Modernity is an experiment in the West. And it's, it's a work in progress, and it's not definitive, even though it's presented as a conclusion. These are conclusions. Equal opportunities are just a given. And I don't think that that's the case. I had a discussion um, with someone one time, I said, the privilege of education, and they said, no, no, education is not a privilege, education is a right. And these are the mantras, you can't, you can't you know, say anything now without someone coming back at you with an equal opportunity um, perspective. Education is a right for everyone. That may be the case, that you have access to education, but education is a privilege, because you may have access to a school, and you may have access to a teacher, and the school is rubbish, and the teacher's rubbish. You don't actually get an education. Education is a privilege. It's a circumstance that you're given as a gift by divine providence, by karma, by destiny, you call it what you will. But unless you meet the right teacher, you won't be woken up to a subject. 